coming in today. So the purpose of bringing you in was to just um, follow up on our telephone consultation, okay? So, and also just to do a more um, thorough assessment of your pain and an examination, okay? So just to go over what we spoke about on the telephone, you kind of started a quite a strenuous exercise routine around four weeks ago. And within a couple of days, you've been having pain here and here on both sides of your neck and also along here, the clavicles, collarbones here on both sides. Um, you've continued to exercise thinking that would ease off and the pain's kind of persisted and you haven't exercised for two to three days. Is that correct? Yes. Yeah, okay. So what I'm going to do today, I'm going to have an examination of your neck, all of this area here, your shoulders, upper arms, lower arms, okay, and just a quick check over your hands. Is that okay? First of all, I'm just going to take some extra details as well, okay? And then we'll do the examination. Is that alright? Yes. Okay, so. You said you've been eating and drinking, okay? Yes. Yep. And you've not had any weight loss? No. Okay. And the purpose of your exercise routine has been just to uh, keep it rather than to lose weight? Yeah. Okay. And you've not had any history, previous history of pain? in the neck or this area before? No. No? Okay. You've not been involved in an accident? No. And you don't have any old injury, like a whiplash injury or anything? No. Okay. And you've not injured yourself or had a fall or been in an accident storm? No. Nothing that will cause you an injury that you're aware of? No. no. Okay. Okay, so you're not on any regular medication? Are you a smoker or a non-smoker? Okay. And you've been taking paracetamol and ibuprofen for the pain? Yes. But it's kind of not quite slightly, um, you're having some pain when you're trying to sleep a bit. Yes. Okay, so we'll give you something a little bit stronger for the pain once I've done your examination, okay? And have you tried anything like an ibuprofen gel or anything like that? No. Okay. I also recommend that you can uh, try some ibuprofen gel. Okay, so the purpose of the examination is just to see if I can see any obvious signs of an injury, so bruising, swelling, things like that. And then I'm also just going to check for any changes of sensation, so things like pins and needles, numbness, tingling, anything like that, okay? And also just looking for any kind of weakness in your grip or any kind of loss of grip or anything, okay? So. Okay, so I'm just going to do your examination, okay? I'm just going to start with the neck area and then we'll just move on to the shoulders, the upper arms and lower arms. Is that alright? Okay, so I'm just going to have a little feel around. I'm just going to start with the neck here. So this is where you're having the pain, just kind of at the side of the neck, just here. Gently feel here. And is there any more pain as I apply some pressures to the neck? No. Yeah, okay. Any pain at the front of the neck here at all? No. Okay. It's fine. Do you mind if I just flip your yeah. um just down a little bit just so I can have a feel of the shoulder? Do you have any pain or tenderness at all along the shoulder here? No. No. And even as I apply some pressure, there's no kind of tenderness at all here. No. Yeah, okay. And how about just the back area here, just at the shoulder, any pain? No. Just have a little bit of room. Okay, so the pain here is just kind of, just directly on the clavicle area here, just the colour bones, yeah. And there's no kind of tenderness or anything here. No. You, you can fully feel what I'm doing here. There's no kind of loss of sensation or anything. No. No, okay. no, no numbness or anything like that. No. Okay, that's fine. And how about just on the back of the neck here? Any pain here at all? No. Okay, I'm just going to have a little feeling. Okay. So 
so no pain at all on the back of the neck. No. Yep. Okay, that's fine. I'm just gonna pop that back off. Do you mind if I just roll your sleeve up here? Is that all right? Okay, so I'm just gonna have a little feel of your shoulder. Okay, I'm just. Just tell me if anywhere feels tender or sore at all. Okay. You're not experiencing any kind of discomfort as I'm just applying some pressure here on your arm. Okay, I'm just going to lift your arm here. Okay, so again, you don't have any kind of loss of sensation here. You can fully feel what I'm doing here. Okay, no tingling, numbness, pins and needles. Okay, I'm just going to do the same with the lower arm here. Again, no loss of sensation. No. no okay. Isn't any pain in the chest at all here? No. Okay. I'm just have a quick look at your hands. Okay. Let's do your hand over for me. Thank you. Okay. So I'm just going to hold um, two fingers up here, and I'd just like you to, with a nice firm grip, just squeeze those fingers for me. That's fine. And you don't feel like you have any weakness in your grip at all. See, your grip hasn't changed or been affected at all since you experience the pain, okay, that's fine. So I can't see any kind of obvious signs of an injury, any bruising or swelling or anything, okay? And you don't have any changes in sensation, you have full feeling in your arm. And no pins or needles, numbness, or tingling or anything, that's fine, I'll just pop that. So back down there for you. Okay, so I'm just going to have a little feel of the other side of your neck there, is that alright? Just turn your head to that side for me, please. Okay. Any pain as you turn your head at all? No. No, okay. And again, I'm just going to roll this sleeve up if you wouldn't mind. Okay, just so I can get to that shoulder there. Okay, I'm just going to have a little feel. Okay, so again, I'm just going to do the same thing on this side. So just tell me if you have any kind of, you know, tingling, numbness, pins and needles or anything. Nothing like that. Okay. And you can fully feel what I'm doing here, your full sensation in your arm. Yeah. Okay. Okay. And no tenderness at all in the uh, joints at all. No. Just have a little look over your hand again this time. Okay, that's fine. And again, I'm just going to hold two fingers up again. If you can just go with a nice firm grip, just close those fingers for me. Thank you, that's fine. You don't feel like there's any weakness in your grip there. Okay, I'm just going to pop this back down again. Thank you. And I'm just going to gently just have a little bit of your shoulder if you don't mind. And you don't have any pain, kind of, tenderness any lower than the collarbones here, just underneath or anything. So the pain is directly here. Yeah, okay. okay. Okay, thank you. That's fine. Okay, I'm just going to get you to do a couple of things for me. What I'd like you to do is just take this hand on the shoulder. And I'm just going to gently push on the shot on the elbow. Okay. Like to tell me if you feel any pain either on the shoulder or on the other side. Okay. So I'm just going to gently apply some pressure. Any pain at all on the shoulders? Okay. Could you just do the same again for me on the other side? Thank you. So again, I'm just going to apply some pressure here just to the elbow. I'm going to gently push. I'm just looking for any pain here or here. Okay. No. Anywhere other than where you are at Dick's Everything. Okay. Also, what I'd like you to do next is just put your hands together like this for me. And just gently pull with just quite a firm grip, if that's okay. And as you do so, is there any pain again in those areas? No. Okay. And any further pain, any kind of more pain or more intense pain? No. no. Okay, that's fine. Okay, that's fine. So I have an extended examination. I can't see any kind of obvious signs of an injury 
or that you've kind of hex off in any way that is kind of obvious um, so what we'll do is I will book you in for a telephone consultation in uh, two weeks time okay so I do think that the pain that you're having is kind of um, muscular pain and is due to the new exercise routine that you're doing so we always recommend with any new exercise routine that you um, start slowly and kind of build up to anything more strenuous, okay? And it just gives your kind of body and muscles a chance to adjust to the routine that you're doing, okay? So um, obviously if you have any concerns in the meantime or the pain increases, you can always come back and we'll take another look. So if the pain hasn't kind of started to decrease over the next two weeks, then we will do some further investigation, okay? And we'll do some bloods and some further tests. How does that sound? Is that okay? So I'll book you an appointment uh, in two weeks' time. It's the same time, two o'clock, okay? Yes. So that would be the 18th. Okay. And what I may do before then is a couple of days before that, if the pain hasn't changed or eased at all, um, it's just I will arrange to call in and collect a blood form if that's okay and we'll do a blood test just so we can have the results back in time for your next appointment is that all right okay so i'll send you a prescription um would you like it directly to the chemist okay and it is a normal chemist that you have your prescriptions to cross to okay so i'm going to prescribe you some codeine for three days okay and if you just kind of try and time that before you uh, go to bed and at least that will help with the pain if it's um, kind of keeping you awake and I am Okay, and then finally, um, so the ibuprofen gel you can ask about at the chemist. It's just an over-the-counter uh, kind of um, gel that you can apply. So you'll just apply that just to the areas that are um, causing you pain. So obviously the neck and all along here, you can actually apply that as a gel. And you can use that as well as taking your pain relief, okay? And that may help. And if you've got any other concerns at all today, I really yeah. think I'll be yeah, okay. So I haven't examined you, I can't actually see anything obvious there other than, um, you know, kind of just what you've spoke about during the telephone consultation and also today. I haven't, you know, had a better look at you. Okay. So. So that prescription has been sent over for you, it's available to collect uh, whenever you're ready, it'll be there available for you today, okay? So, and your appointment's booked uh, for two weeks time, and also, like I say, if your pain hasn't eased at all, maybe around three to four days before your telephone consultation, if you can call us, call up, and we will arrange to do a blood test, okay? So we can have the results in time for that consultation. Okay, perfect. Okay. That's all today then. Okay, thank you. Bye-bye.